Hey, what is up guys? Today we're gonna to be doing my favorite thing, eating. I moved here in January of this year, and the first thing that someone told me as I got off the plane from New York was, try the chili, dude. Uh, oh, oh, oh okay, cool, sweet. Um, hi, also, nice to meet you. Oh yeah, whatever, try the freaking chili, bro. And that's how my first interaction went. Now finally, after three months of waiting, I found the perfect time to go about doing exactly that. Today, I'm gonna to be trying chili from three different locations. Skyline, Gold Star, and a mystery location. So without further ado, let's get to it. Bitch better have my money. So first stop is gonna be Skyline. This is the one I've heard most about by far. Fun fact, Skyline is named Skyline because the original store sits on a great area that has a perfect view of the Cincinnati skyline. And here it is, Skyline Chili. Here's a quick look at the menu. We're gonna be getting a five-way and a cheese coney. Staples at this restaurant and many like it. And there are the beauties. Let's get down to it. See what they got. Mm. Oh, yeah. See that cheese? You see that? Wow. Woo! That was some great stuff. That was some top quality chili. Stop it. Gold Star is gonna have to do something special. They're up against the competition. I can see why Skyline is such a well-respected and loved chili company. They just, they just make you so happy. They give you food and then they just throw cheese on it. And what are you supposed to do, not love them? I mean, let's be real people at Gold Star. Let's see what you got. Chili fact, the sister of the CEO of Gold Star Chili is married to the mayor of Cincinnati. Now that just doesn't seem fair to me. And so it is on to restaurant number two. We are at Gold Star Chili. Here's another shot of their menu. Again, we'll be getting the five-way, even though for some reason I pointed at the three-way. This is why I'm making a YouTube video, and I am not a doctor. And without further ado, let us begin on chili number two. So I gotta say, Gold Star Chili, it's, it's, it's very similar, not too similar, but what I have noticed is that the meat to spaghetti to cheese ratio is a little bit different. Same amount of cheese, but it's a more balanced ratio of, of pasta to meat. And I appreciate that. I want to have the ability to judge both of those equally. Because if you want to have good meat or good pasta and try to hide it with good beef, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to taste it. And I'm going to... I'm gonna, I'm gonna tell you how I feel. But this is great stuff. This is really great stuff. Oh, wow. God, I love cheese. Woo! Two chili places down, one to go. Gold Star, I gotta say, I always heard good things about Skyline, and I always heard people talking down about Gold Star, probably because of the friends and family I know in the area. But I was pretty surprised at how good Gold Star was. You know, it's this is a really tight competition, and I guess you're gonna have to wait for the third mystery location to break that tie. So for the big reveal, the third location, Chile today, is gonna be Camp Washington, Chile. They've been around for over 75 years, and they're often thought of as the best chili place in Cincinnati. So we're gonna take these two staples and compare it to the chili place in Cincinnati. Let's see what they got. Here we are at the third and final restaurant, Camp Washington. Let's take a look at the menu. Again, I have trouble, but at least this time, I point to the right chili. We will get the five-way and the cheese coney. And look at that reveal. Only thing left is to dig in. So, when I ordered here, I might have forgot to order the small version. I've been having three lunches in about an hour. Probably would have been a better idea. But um, even then, I completely finished 
everything. Oh my god. I'm gonna be honest, I don't think I've ever eaten this much cheese in my entire life. I... I am so happy I'm not lactose intolerant, I swear. This would not be as great of a day as it has been so far. I've eaten so much cheese. And then, as I'm leaving Camp Washington, they're like, hey, you want some ice cream? I'm like, yes, here. But now that, that is service. If there's anywhere that has shown me fantastic service, it is Camp Washington. So, I guess the only thing left to say is, let's go to the judges. Uh, <laughs> why did I do this? Uh. All right, guys, so now I have the opportunity to judge who had the best chili. First things first, I suggest anyone, if you're gonna do what I did, don't do it in an hour. Space it out, because you're gonna hate yourself. So, a decision must be made. Skyline, first impression was great. I love the food, I love the service, but it came down to two things. The cheese didn't taste fresh. It tasted fake, and, and I could have done without so much pasta. Gold Star, their pasta to meat ratio was on point, I have to say, props for that. Cheese along the same side as Skyline, good, but not the best. Now, if anyone knows chili here in Cincinnati, you'll know the staple camp Washington one of the oldest chili places in the city, over 75 years old, and as it should be, Camp Washington's the winner. I gotta give it to them. Camp Washington, you did your stuff. You're there for a reason. 75 years is a long time, and you've earned it. So thank you guys for coming with me on this adventure. I had a great time. My stomach, not so much, and my toilet, probably not tomorrow. But for right now, have a good night, guys. Thank you so much. I appreciate it, and I'm going to go lie down. The wife of Gold Star Chili, of the mayor of Cincinnati, of the CEO, is the sister of the wife of the CEO of Gold Star Chili, is the, the wife of Cincinnati.